Like to keep it all alive, man. This is what you're gonna encounter when you load up these games. Make sure my head ain't in the way. Alright, well, it runs fine when you load up different things. Let's see, good player. Welcome to the early access of the bullet. You are playing an early version of the game. This is subject to change. If you encounter any difficulties or bugs, feel free. Cool, cool. So I didn't know that this was an early access. So I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to just give it a good, good play. And when it comes out, we'll come to it again. How about that? Solid options in the menu. Bump that up a little bit. Change as well. Live and leaving settings. Thank you for letting me know. Controls. Stay that as is right now. I mean, calibrate what? saving going on, so at least it looks like we're we'll going to be keeping our stuff. Jump on the enemies. I like how we ain't got blood all over the place. Okay, keep it clean.
less amount of money you got, the more damage you have. <clears throat> All right. Yeah. 
No.
Sala to me is a roguelite, so when you die, um, you lose everything that you got, but there is permanent things that you keep, which is always good. Um, the gameplay feels solid to me. I like how you can jump on enemies as an alternative to hitting them. I haven't seen that in a long time. Um, I like all the different weapon types uh, for these type of games is based on guns. There needs to be like heavy impact, like really do something special when you shoot each type of gun. It should feel different um, with each type of gun that you shoot. Really just like hammering on the different type of weapons that you can get. But I like it, I like the style. Um, that one thing on the distortion, uh, when things is in the way, kind of I think they increase that bubble a little bit um, in some areas. I like the lightning effects, definitely increase the bloom and make them more heavier to really give it the, the look that you're going for. Um, areas look nice. Um, I, I see the simple polygonal effect. Um, I don't know if that's meant to be in there. I guess I'll wait until the game uh, comes out. But uh, yeah, it's pretty solid to me, man. Definitely more indicators on where you can jump at. And when enemies shoot, you need to be a little bit more foregrounded. I'm pretty sure there's going to be tons of more types of enemies that need to be a little bit more uh, precise on what the enemy is doing so that you can tell and dodge it effectively. I love the smoke effects, by the way. Um, the jumps and the second thing is pretty cool. But, uh, I guess the icons on the screen. Maybe let them jump out at you more. Like that right there. Everything just kind of blends in as far as the UI. I like how it glows though. But just let it pop out a little bit more and move. Like sway when he's moving back and forth. And you know when you jump, it jump, it kind of jumps up with you and all that. Again, I don't know what engine this is on. But, uh, but yeah, man. I like it. Well, I don't want to hit first today with you. <laughs> Definitely going to be going through a little bit more. 